All right, quick video. Dylan F1 commented on the video I posted about how to install PP filters in a set of Corsa. And he said, how do I download it if I just have the .ini file? So I assume you mean, how do I install it if you just have the .ini? Uh, to answer your question, you can do that. I'm gonna show you how to do that in this video. How to install a PP filter with just the .ini. For anyone who doesn't know the .ini file, that is the file that has all the configuration settings for the PP filter. And you can install a PP filter with just that file. So what you're gonna do, come over to Content Manager, open it up, come to the top here where it says Assetto Corsa, click that, go to the Video tab here on the left, come over to where it says Filter, okay? This is where all of your current PP filters that you have installed already are listed. All you're gonna do is come to the right where it says Manage beside it, click Manage, it's gonna open up this section, okay? Down at the bottom where it says folder right here, click folder, all right? So this folder right here is where all of your current PP filter INI files are, all right? So for example, if I right click this, go to properties, you can see right here, configuration settings dot INI. So all you're gonna do is if you have a PP filter that you downloaded, it's just the .ini, just drag and drop that file into this directory, all right? If we go to the top right here, you can see the full directory. C, program files, 86, Steam, Steam apps, common, a set of courses, system, CFG, PP filters, okay? So that's the full directory. It's easiest to just open it through Content Manager, which I just showed in the video, okay? So all you're gonna do is drag and drop or copy and paste that INI into this directory. You're gonna come back to Content Manager, come over here to a set of course of video filter, and you're gonna see that new PP filter installed. So there you go. That's how to install a PP filter in a set of course if you just have the INI file.